Okay, I've been working out problems and I feel pretty good about things. I'm ready to take a quiz. And in fact, I need to take the fun quiz this first week. So I was told that I was in the technical setup folder in, under the content tab. So I can either scroll down here and hit content or hit the tab on the left here. There it is, technical setup. And here's quizzes. So I'll go in there. And of course, I'm watching the quizzes video. And that's kind of neat. But uh, this is what I need to take, the fun practice quiz. So take a look at that. And there's a time limit of 25 minutes. Uh, normally, if I'm taking a regular chapter quiz, uh, I would have two problems, which would be based on the lecture material for that week. Um, most likely uh, taken from the essential 10 problems and just a, numbers, a few numbers changed. And so I would have to complete those two problems in 25 minutes, probably one from each lecture for that week on a Tuesday, Thursday. Um, if it were a summer semester, there are three lectures a week, and so you would have three problems to complete in 40 minutes. So let's uh, continue and take a look at this. Uh, my physics instructor's name is, it's not Feynman, even though he's a pretty good instructor, or Stephen Hawking. Boy, I'd love to take a class with Neil deGrasse Tyson. Uh, I'll, I'll settle on Dr. John Goldman and we'll proceed. So if you proceed, then your, your answer is accepted. You can always go back and change it. Uh, like I said, you only have two uh, or three problems to set answers to, and you'll do the calculations and then, and then select your answer. Um, let's uh, go all the way to the end here. Here's an actual physics type problem, at least mathematics. An inch is 2.54 centimeters long. The standard exam page is 8.5 inches by 11 inches. The area of a page in square centimeters is. So I could calculate what the area is in square inches by multiplying 8.5 times 11 and then converting that to square centimeters. Well, let's try that. 8.5 times 11 is 93.5 square inches. And then I need to do the two conversions of um, inches to centimeters. There's 2.54 centimeters per inch. So I'm going to multiply this by 2.54 twice. And I get 603 square centimeters. So that would be my answer there. OK, I left the four of the answers here unanswered, but we're going to uh, save and submit. And I'm going to say OK over here. And so I'm logged into the web server of Callan Community College. My instructor's name is John Goldman. I'm glad I got that right. And I missed uh, three of them. I guess I had already answered one. And um, I got this last one right, 603 square centimeters. So I'm ready for my scoring. And uh, so I took the quiz. I can take this uh, fun quiz as many times as I wish just for practice. So I can go right back in and do it again if I wish. Uh, let's close that. That's it. Um, so when you need to take a quiz for a chapter, let's go down in the content here. And here are the weekly quizzes. And there's a deadline date for each one. So make sure that you know the material from that week for the two lectures of that week. And I've done the essential 10 for those associate lectures to get yourself ready for the quiz and then take the quiz by midnight on Sunday night. Best wishes.